Hi Tevens, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to set up the Matinge Bot. Now a couple of things to note about Matinge Bot is it's one of the most sophisticated bot and it does help you to trade the market even in the tiniest bits of market movement. You're able to create different Matinge structures to cover up for different kind of market scenarios and it is one of the bot that has the capacity to be profitable no matter the scenarios of the market. So we want to go straight into the Matinge system. So you want to click on get started. Started. Next, we want to select what type of Matinge bot we want to create. Is this a bot for sports or a bot for futures? Now, what is the difference? The difference between that is the bot on sports is going to this year entry into the market you choose as the price begins to drop. And why the bot for future? It's able to do both ways. So you're able to create settings that is able to cover if the market is going up or if the market is going down. Now, the Matinge bot is so simplified also because every Every day in the Tafabot Signal group, we do send the trade configurations that you can directly use on your Matsingir bot. So if you're not yet on the group, you want to be in the Tafabot trade setup channel on Telegram. So over here, you can see a trade setup that was posted today. And every day, you're going to get a fresh new setup that you can always use. And if you do not want to put the setup yourself, you can directly copy any of the trader in the mirror settings that is using the setup and you don't have to lift the finger. So over here we have a setup for BTC and we're going to be creating the Matinge structure for this setup that we have over here for BTC, price movement 32, average movement 6 and strategy mode is short. So let's go back to our Tafabot app. This setup is for futures. So when you do have a setup for sports, you're going to see the difference. So you have over here at the top, the setup says this is for futures. When you do have a setup for sports, if we do go from up here, you're going to find a setup for sport like this is a setup for sport with a green arrow means you're able to use the setup on sport at the same time on futures. Now, when they're set up that you can only use on futures, you're going to have the red arrows down. So I want to go ahead to create the setup for BTC just like this. So we're going to head straight into the Tafabot app again. So we want to select Futures Bot. And then you're going to have the Futures Notice. You want to accept the Future Notice. I'm going to select the Market BTC. And the strategy is short, like you can find already in the setup. Strategy mode short. You want to proceed to the Matinga configuration. So next you're going to see the Auto configuration. So if you're using the predefined settings, what you want to do is the Tafabot Auto configuration. So move over here, we need to select the exchange that we want to trade on using the setup. So we're going to select Binance or any of your exchange that you want to use. Next, you need to put in the strategy period, which if we go back to the setup, you can find strategy period right over here as five. So I'm going to put in five over there. Next, you want to put in your bot leverage. And you can also see from the setup, this is 10. And you're able to use this on auto leverage and auto deliverage. So want to use the setup on auto the leverage. And this simply means that if your setup ever goes wrong, if the market goes against you, the bot is going to automatically deliver your setup, even if you're on a 10S to the lowest possible leverage it can go. So yeah, we want to put in the price movement, 33. We want to put in the average, 6, just like we saw in the configuration. We want to put in the take profit, 0 0.5. And then we need to proceed. And right over here is going to tell us all the details about our bot based on the configuration we just entered and what should be our expected result. So it tells us after five trade, five trade simply means we have a five strategy period. And this means that the bot is going to take profit every time up to five times. And then we're going to have minimum of 45 cents to $250 based on the market movement. Once again, you want to note that this is an estimated profit. It all depends on how the market moves based on your configuration. So right over here, you, you could change your bot's name. So you could call it whatever bot you want it to be. So we're going to say this is a sniper Matinga bot. And next, you want to proceed to activating the bot. So you're going to click on create bot. So now we're creating the BTC Matinga bot using the strategy that was given. Yeah, you have your sniper bot and you could also edit the setup at any point. And now the next thing you need to do is to start up the bot. So you're going to click on the big red icon there that shows off and you're going to see start, pause. So you want to click on on and activate the bot. 
at this point your bot is started once it gets into a trade you're going to see the active trade right around here with all the details about the trade as it makes profit you're going to see the total profit over here and you could see the chart between each of the profit now if your bot is not trading after activating this for a while you want to come back to your bot page if you do go back you want to go back to the bot page over here and if there's an error on your bot it's going to show you what the message is could be your api keys are not connected correctly and all your exchange is not available or not allowing to trade so you're going to see that if there's no message your bot should be trading in the next couple minutes Happy trading, tough ends.